Let's write the structure for 3-methylhexane. So first off, we see that it ends in A-N-E. That means we're going to have this alkane here. It's going to be carbon atoms connected with single bonds surrounded by hydrogen. So we know that we'll have single bonded carbon atoms. And then hex, that means six. So we're going to have six of those single bonded carbon atoms. That'll look like this. So we have our six carbon atoms. We have our single bonds. And we can number them one, two, three through six. The three here tells us that we'll have a methyl group on the third carbon. A methyl group, that's just CH3. We're just adding one carbon onto this carbon here. That looks like this. So we have our alkane because of the ANE, all single bonds. The hex means we have the longest chain, six carbons. And the methyl, we put that on the third carbon, one, two, three. And because we have an alkane here, each carbon would be bonded to four things. So we'd have one, two, three hydrogens here, one, two here, and so on. We could also draw it like this in a more condensed format here, where we have our one, two, three, four, five, six carbons, then our methyl group right here. Finally, if we wanted to look at a molecular model, that would look like this. So this is the formula for 3-methylhexane, and this is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.